It's my wife, that Alexa, was doing my head in the other day. I said, how do you turn her off? She said, walk through the room naked. Unbelievable. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the video. My name's Phil, as you all well know. And today I'm doing something a little bit different, something a little bit crazy. As you know, with this channel, I'm always doing something different or crazy. And today we're doing the alphabet of Xbox 360 games. So the A is for, B is for, C is for, D is for, E, where, E is for, and one more F is for. I can't remember the rest. We'll make it up as we go along. But yes, so this is the video idea. I've come up with it. What do you think? Do you think it's a clever idea or do you think I'm just a big cunt? Fair enough. 49 seconds. I bet. I've fucked that one up, haven't I? But yes, uh, welcome to the video. This is uh, so we're going to begin. Yeah, are you ready? So A is for what do you think it's going to be? It's pretty, yeah. Assassin's Creed name. Fucking CEX again. I will stab them all. If you read in the news tomorrow that someone has stabbed them all, that wasn't me. That was just maybe a copycat. Well, not really a copycat because I didn't do it, did I? Assassin's Creed 2, to be precise. He's a moody cunt. There you go. Said the word again. There you go. Um, welcome to the channel, by the way. <laughs> if you are uh, unfamiliar with the word, the C word, or you are not a big fan of it, this might not be the channel for you. Uh, if, however, you like childish humour, welcome. Uh, so B is for, what do you think it's going to be? Could be Beavers and Butthead. Could be Big Dick 7. That's a good game. That sold really well on the Xbox. No, just mine. Fair enough. That was just me wanking into a mirror. Bioshock. <laughs> there you go. Bioshock. The Bioshock games. Um, I didn't say anything about Assassin's Creed, did I? Assassin's Creed, obviously, lots of games. Still going today. In fact, they're making a new one. And I think it's set around the times of your... I'm not sure. I can't remember. But it looks really good wherever it's set. Um, yeah, so Bioshock. <clears throat> three games in this. Uh, never really made another one, did they? It was a shame. We never really got a, a fourth game. Um, but yes, there you go. Uh, Bioshock is B. Of, and rightly so. Could have been Batman. Could have been Batman, but it wasn't. It was, it was uh, fuck, what was it again? Bioshock. Bib Blow. Bibbly Bib Bab, as it was also known. C. What's C for? Am I that obvious? Have you? Am I that obvious by now? Yes, I am. It's Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the first one. Um, I wanted the second one, but let's face it, without this one, there was nothing. My voice is going, <clears throat> excuse me, my voice is going. Call of Duty, obviously still going today. Shit now, but back here, back this day, ooh, it was like dipping your cock in a lovely big gravy boat and then serving it to that fuckhead family that kept calling you an arsehole. Yes, we've all worked in catering. <laughs> Never, never done that? Fair enough. I always liked wanking in their soup. I always thought, hmm, you want some extra salt? <laughs> you peaked! You dirty boys and girls, you peaked at the game and ruined it now. It's a D. D is for fucking CX again. Dead Island. And they're still going. Number two was sensational. It was like having a sponge bath with Megan Fox, and she hadn't, couldn't use her hands. Oh, cheeky cow. Uh, it was like having a sponge pudding with Jennifer Aniston, or Aniston, or whatever the fuck her name is. Who cares? She's got tits and a minge. That'll do me. E is for Earth Defense Force Insect Armageddon. Um, any of the Earth Defense Force games. I love them. They're lovely. Um, so, yeah, this is this is a great game, and good fun if you're with your mates. Good fun. There you go. Yay! I became a performing seal for a few seconds there. And that was probably in the microphone. It was fucking loud. So enjoy the clapping. F. What's F for? What the fuck would F be for? Hmm. Fallout 3, of course. Uh, Fallout 3, one of the greatest games ever to be released on the console. Came out of nowhere, took us all by surprise and fucked us up the bomb. This was one hell of a game. <laughs> one hell of a game. Super Mutant style. Right up the Ooh. And it made us, it filled us full of its hot Super Mutant jizzle. Fallout 3, look at him, he's so moody on the front. You tell me this isn't based on Warcraft, Warfarm, Warflimbang, 
Warfling Bung, which is Korean for Warhammer. Um, and I will call you a liar and a cad, sir. We'll meet at dawn with pistols drawn. Um, and we'll shoot our honour be true. I don't know where that came from. I think it's possibly a saying from something, or I've just made it up. If I have, patent pending. Fuck off. But yes, Far Cry. No, fucking Far Cry. Fallout 3. <laughs> oh, the video's fucked already. The video's fucked already. I've ruined it. I've ruined the video. Whatever. Gee, gee. <laughs> I'm balls in it. I haven't even had a drink. I'm just a zinc. I haven't had anything to drink, and I'm balls in it up already. G is for... It was originally going to be Ghostbusters, and then I realised Gears of War existed. I thought, what the fuck are you doing? Obviously, one of the most original games for the Xbox, other than another famous one that might be coming up. <laughs> uh, but yes, Gears of War. We're on number five now, but six games in total. Seven if you include Tactics. What a set of games. The manliest set of games you've ever seen. So manly it comes in a metal tin to protect you from how insanely... Look at the fucking... Look at that. Just beasts beating the shit out of each other. Uh, again, Warhammer references in this one, I feel. I could be wrong, but hey-ho. <clears throat> there was a hoodie I always wanted for Gears of War, and it was a hoodie. And when you lifted it, it had brain splatter in the hood. It was so badass, and I never got it. I think it was an official one, but I never got it. H. What could it be for? Half of life, Halo. <laughs> I'm fucking it up! I'm fucking it up! Halo, should I just start again? I don't start again. <laughs> oh, he say the word. Halo Free, <laughs> one of the best, <laughs> one of the best games. Uh, it was really good. I remember this coming out and going, oh, and it was like, oh, it was lovely. Oh, and everybody went, oh, this is good. It made us feel all yummy inside, like we'd been filled with jam, like our insides had been replaced by chocolate. It was lovely. Halo Three, there you go. Good game. Next one for I. I was a bit restricted on this one, but it's Injustice 2. Or Injustice, not Injustice 2. Fucked it up again. That's the next letter fucked up. Injustice. There he is. Superman, crazy lady, and the Russian beast himself. Yes. Uh, Solomon Grandi or something, wasn't it? Um, <clears throat> yeah, really good game. Really good game. Good beat him up. Um, came from out of nowhere, like a rocking chair. And interfered with your earlobes. Um, yes, it was a good game. Injustice, very good. Enjoyed it. It was like ooh, it was like covering myself in treacle and standing next to a beehive and going, "Come on, you little beasts, have a little, have a little vibrate on me," especially around the penal area. Um, just cause J for fuck me, I fucked it up again. J for just cause two. Um, there was quite a few that it could have been, but it is just cause too, because I'm not kidding you. I could have so much fun with this game even now. I still love this game. It's fucking brilliant. So yes, just cause two. There you go. Uh, J. <clears throat> K is for, there you go. I'm going for a connect game. Star Wars. I was talking to someone. I can't remember who it was, who I mentioned it to, but I was talking to someone on, um, my comments the other day and i mentioned that yes there is something quite strange about dancing as han solo to jason derulo's riding solo uh is one of the most weirdest things you can ever do but the lightsaber thing is not too bad the pod race is quite fun and it's probably one of the better uh connect ones um other than rise of nightmares i've got it now wait a minute something's coming up what's this What's this? That's right. Yes. Um, for those of you who don't understand, and I've just swore at you, that was a game I was after. In fact, I don't remember anyone being against me getting it. In fact, some people did actually offer to give me a copy of it. But uh, I'm still sticking my finger up because I won and you said I couldn't do it and I need this. L is <laughs> it's for Left for Dead. I fucked it up again because I haven't shown the game. Do it right. L is for Left for Dead. Um, there it is. Four fingers. Old four fingers there. 
He's very good. Very bad. He can't do any thumb wars. And he certainly can't do, you know, that thing you did for your nan who used to hang like that and he used to wrap the yarn around. He couldn't do that, could he? Also can't open doors. So he's the most unthreatening zombie ever. He's only got the four fingers. Um, could you open? You couldn't grip, could you? If you haven't got a thumb, you'd be like... Yes, left for the... <clears throat> could you wank? You could wank. You just won't be able to... On the top. And then... Like holding... A... Hold it on the end. Ready to burst. When it's about to come, just let go. And it'll... And knock the hat off! Wow! Oh, fuck me! I did! Shut your face. And my terrible hat... I have to have it cut this week. Uh, we're going away for the weekend. I've got to have it cut. Um, yes. Not circumcise my hair. M is for Mass Effect 2, which is the best Mass Effect, in my opinion. Um, one was a bit clanky. Three was brilliant, but number two's plot felt I liked it more. And Andromeda, I wanted to like it so much. I'm so disappointed in Andromeda. It had so much promise, didn't it? It it was like a it was like a hooker standing at the corner going, follow me. Follow me. And then when you went down there, there was just a hedgehog with his face stuck in a bun, just going, hey, I'm stuck in the bun. And you were like, where's the prostitute gone? It's like, I'm not me. Like, I don't understand what you are, but where's the prostitute disappeared to? That was that was Andromeda, was a hedgehog with, a, yeah, a prostituteless street. N is for Ninja Kaidan. Yeah, fuck you um, which is Japanese for Ninja Gaiden 2. I don't know why they would say fuck you at the end. Probably just their dialect. And really they're welcoming you into their small home where you can eat sandwiches and watch uh, a game show of people farting on each other. <laughs> which seems to be the style of Japan at the time. But yes, Ninja Gaiden 2. Uh, very fun. Good stuff. Yeah, really good game. Hard as fuck. Horrible. This one, um, the O, oh, what could it be for? Mm, or could it be mm, one chan bar? No, it's not, because I've shown that game enough. It's the orange box. There's Gordon Freeman, looking a bit like me. Mm, I'm Gordon Freeman, mm, with scowling face. He's a badass, by the way. And then there's Grinning Gunner Guy. Here he is. What? Uh, he's, that's his voice in the game as well. And then a picture of a guy falling down a portal. Yes, one of the best games ever made for this console. And it's worth about £12. It, seriously, it's not going to get any cheaper. Get this game. If you don't get anything else this year, get this fucking game. It is amazing. Three games. Excuse me, a little bit of Wendy Pops for you guys and girls there. A little bit of Wendy Pops. Well done. Portal 2. I fucked it up again. <laughs> P is for Portal 2. Um, which I love this game, and uh, yeah, it's good fun. Um, the story mode is great. The dual mode you play with your friends is great. Uh, yeah, it's a really good game, and it, it was really fleshed out, and I like the fact that they came back with Portal 2 and made it better than Portal, if that could even be done. But it's very good. Hard as fucking nails, though, but very good. Yes. <clears throat> Q is for Quantum of Solace. Um, which was actually, the film was shit, but the game was actually quite good. Um, I like Bloodstone a little bit more, but Quantum of Solace was a good game and definitely one to pick up if you've got a little bit of spare cash, about five pounds. So shut your faces and stop moaning. Um, my mind just farted then. Did you see that? Did you literally just see what I just did? My mind just went, uh, and nothing was there. My mouth wasn't moving. My brain wasn't working. My ass was working. I've just let out a little Tommy squeaker. Not sure if it'll pick it up on the microphone. So I'm sorry. I do apologize. You'll just have to settle for the Windy Pops. Uh, but certainly my stomach hasn't settled for the Windy Pops because it's coming out my ass as well. So when it starts to leak out the ass is when you really need to go and see a doctor. And I'm not at that point. I'm quite regular. I'm quite regular. I poo every day at 11 o'clock like clockwork. Oh, it comes out of me like a like a half melted Mars bar. It just plops, <laughs> it plops out and uh, and falls in there like a ghost, like it never existed, um, like a like a chocolate whisper. It's gone. Um, R is for Red Dead Redemption. I can't just talk about crap for five seconds then. Uh, this is a great game and um, very good. Uh, we wouldn't have number two if we didn't have number one. Plot's brilliant. 
the main protagonist is wonderful. Uh, the characters in there are very fleshed out. The towns are good, and it's a good game. So shut your face and go and get it and stop moaning. Always moaning. Oh, Phil. Oh, it hurts when I rub it. Stop rubbing it then. Need to get a job. So. S is for Skyrim. I got this the other day. I wanted to show it off again. Um, yeah, S is for Skyrim. I haven't played it yet. Um, last night just didn't happen. I was supposed to make a video, and then I looked at the time, and I said to my son, oh, shit, you've got to go to bed. <laughs> it was so late. Um, but, yeah, there you go. Skyrim, Skyrim. Very good. S for Skyrim. You know Skyrim. You don't need me to tell you. T. What's T for? Ooh, could be. Could be. I think you can see the game. You cheeky fuckers. You've looked at it. It's Tomb Raider Underworld. Look at the tits. The tits. Um, I just shouted tits very loud at you then. Lara Croft there. This is possibly the sexiest, coolest, and most awesome Lara Croft I've ever seen in one of the sexiest, coolest, and most awesome Tomb Raider games I've ever seen. This is fucking badass. It's a great game. Um, it is really good. It's like everything you want Tomb Raider to be. There's tombs. There's... Oh, it's so good. It's The combat's great. She's great. I think she's actually... And I'm, this sounds really lame, but I mean it. She is possibly the most beautiful Lara Croft I've ever seen, ever, on a game. She looks the most perfect you'd ever want Lara Croft to look. This is my favourite Tomb Raider. Thank you very much. Legend is next. Although I have all the originals, I remember playing Tomb Raider 2 when I was at school, and everybody going, oh, I'm at this level, oh, I'm at that level. And I used to think, oh, fuck off and die, you cunt. I did. I'll fucking see X sticker again. It's all right, so I'm getting the sticker off my finger, not a bogey. Fucking hell. You is for Unreal Tournament. And uh, look at him. He looks a bit like Dom from Gears of War, but it's not. Look at the blue. It's Electric Man. Um, that was a sound effect I made, not the electric. Um, but it was very convincing. Uh, Unreal Tournament, run around, shoot people in the face, deathmatch style. They were march in the same temple as Quake Arena, that kind of game. <clears throat> Thumbs up! But you know, uh, not up the bum. Not up the bum, but thumbs definitely up. V is for Vanquish. Look at him doing a pose with his gun. He's like, look at my cock, and then I shoot my gun. Um, he's not even sliding on the floor. He's just sitting in an alluring pose. He wants you to subscribe to his OnlyFans and pay him $5 to get his cock and balls out. Dirty robot boy! But a great game. And combat's mental on this. One of the best. Wish it was a two-player, but a very good game. W is for wet. There she is again. What a voluptuous lady. She is lovely. And she's a badass in this as well. She spends most of the game jumping around like a nutcase. Shooting people in bullet time. Max Payne style while... Cool Quentin Tarantino style rockabilly punk music plays at full blast as you negotiate your way around arenas, jumping up poles, kicking people, slashing people with swords, rolling around like a fucking maniac and killing everybody in sight. It's a badass game. Bye now. Shut your face. Hurry up. X is for XCOM. Shadows of people. Enemy Unknown, where you go around shooting the aliens. A very good game. Uh, Turn-based, sort of in the same kind of quantum as that. Very good game, though. Yes, XCOM Enemy Unknown. But you do know what the enemy is. It's aliens. Last two. Last two, guys. This one's a bit of my own one. Plus, I also didn't have many Ys. You star. It's the most fun you could have with your clothes on. And you can have them off if you want to. Um, it will record you. Mm, I don't know if it saves it on a database. You read your little tits out going, Ooh, I'm Rambo. Ooh. Um, that was a weird thing to say. But yes, um, you can play in many films, such as The Godfather, Meet the Fuckers, Wizard of Oz, Kick-Ass, Flutmanoon. What's that at the top? The Hangover, 300, and others. R Terminator. Really good game. Very cool. Very funny. And if you've got friends around, it's really <laughs> worth playing because it is good fun. It is funny when you act the scenes out. Yeah. Bit of green screen. Bit of green screen tomfoolery there. <laughs> um, last one isn't really a Z. I do apologize. It is... Zero. 
Not perfect dark zero. I didn't have a Z. Fuck off. I thought there was nothing zombies. Um, zombies. I haven't got anything zombies. But yes, there you go. Perfect dark zero. There she is. Voluptuous lady with lovely lips. And she's got a big gun as well. Yes. So there you go. There's my A to Z of Xbox 360 games. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, and if you did enjoy it, subscribe, comment, leave a like. Send me a letter, send me a postcard, send me a picture of your boobs. What are you wearing? Is it frilly? Is it silky? Can it be pulled down quickly? Does it have little strings at the side? Can be pulled and then it drops. Um, if you are a man, obviously, then still answer those questions. You may like that kind of shit, and I'm into that too, so fair play. Let's meet up. Let's let's bumble. <laughs> I don't know where any of that shit just came from. But no, thank you very much for joining me on this video. Hopefully you're having a wonderful week. Um, I may not upload again till mm, maybe Sunday or Monday um, because I'm going away for the weekend. So this plus Thursday, fuck all watches on a Thursday. Thursday's like fucking, I don't know, hanky panky night or something. I think you're all having it off and you're like, fuck that. I'm not watching any YouTube. I'm too busy getting balls deep in my partner, wife or boyfriend, depending on if you are a homo sex. That's fine. I don't mind. I'm just not interested in being penetrated up my rear. Um, but it's fine. You know, it's, hey, that was Windy Pops at the same time. Any holds a goal. Um, but yes, welcome to the video. Why am I welcoming you? This is the end of the video. Um, I've made a decision. There's two things I want to say. Made a decision. First one is any updates from now on. If I need to update you on the channel, if I just want to talk to you and chill out and just have a bit of a 10 minutes, just blah, 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 blah. It will be put as an update. OK, I'm not going to do this on the gaming videos because what's happening is new people are turning up. They're listening to me go. And yeah, so anyway, I pulled it out of the sides of my trousers and the lady said to come, come into the shop anymore. That's that's not useful. They don't want to hear that when the video is called Top 25 Xbox Games. And there's me talking about the fact I got my luncheon meat out in the middle of Little. Um, <laughs> so it'll be a game video and then probably an update video once every week or so or if i've got something to say okay um and I, that means that new new people who are coming into the channel can watch the gaming stuff and obviously if you like that kind of stuff and you haven't got to listen to me warble about the fact that you know i tried to to buy medication it cost me 11 pound fucking 11 quid for medication in the uk fuck off if you're in the US, you're going, fucking 11 quid, fuck me, 150 pounds. If I had to buy it from that weird website that tells you that it's special tablets, it shows old people dancing and playing bowls in the garden and having a laugh at a barbecue because they've stopped their piles for once. They're weird videos, aren't they? Um, but yeah, so thank you very much for, for joining me on this video. Um, I have, um, so people asked me recently, is there a way that we can contribute or tip I said no, because I'm not monetized. Um, I have no plans of monetizing anytime soon. Um, but uh, what I did was a lot of people said, well, you know, if, if it's there, we can do it. <clears throat> so I've, I've enabled the super thanks. I'm sorry, guys. You may think I'm a cunt. Fair enough. If you do, I do apologize. You may want to leave the channel because I've done it. Fair enough. Um, but it, it doesn't, I'm not asking for anything. But it's there for people who said that they, they wanted to donate. I've had people offer to send me stuff as well. I don't have a P.O. box. Um, I don't have one. And um, it's going to cost me like 50 quid a month for a P.O. box. So probably when the channel gets much bigger, we'll, we'll, we'll get a, a P.O. box. But guys, you, you don't need to send me things or anything. Unless there's something really funny you want to send me, then hold fire. And then obviously, if the channel gets much bigger and we get a bit more demand for it, I will I will look into a, a P.O. box. I did ask my wife and she said, if you send our address out on the Internet, I will divorce you and then I will chop your cock off, um, which I think is a reasonable response. She's a sensible woman um, and makes sense. It's it's our family home. So I'm, I'm not you guys. But obviously, if I start putting out things public, that's our, my actual address. I don't I don't particularly want that. Um, but yeah, so yeah, that's it. If you, if you do want to obviously contact, thank you. You don't have to, I'm not doing this for that. I'm doing it because it's fun. Um, but I have had a few people kind of go, oh, well, you know, I want to, I want to give you some money so you can get a certain game I want you to talk about or 
that's up to you guys. I, there's no there's no pressure there at all. But thank you very much for those of you who have shown so much support over the last three months. We're still here. Look at us. Over a thousand subs. Lovely. Uh, but yeah, so there'll probably be maybe a video on the Sunday um, because they never get uploaded tomorrow. And yeah, from then on. So guys, thank you very much. If you're new to the channel, uh, drop us a subscription and I will talk about more games at some point. Um, but if you are already here, and you enjoyed this. Well, brilliant. What do you want? A fucking medal? No, I'm joking. Thank you very much, guys. And I'll see you in the next video. But until then, um, have a good week, I suppose. You know, just be careful. Just look both ways as you cross the street. Look both ways. Oh, here's a question for you. How do you get a baby astronaut to sleep? You rock it. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>